What exactly is an RUV? It's a recreational utility vehicle. In other words, something that delivers big time fun on every outing. It can carry your entire family and your gear and has the capability to take you anywhere from busy highways to off the grid adventures. It's everything you need. Hi, I'm Steve from Thor Motor Coach and this is the 2022 Gemini all wheel drive RUV. Your Gemini all wheel drive has two floor plans and we're gonna start right in here the 23TW. Taking a look around our living area, we have a dream dinette. So how about this? You are finally set up. You break out that bottle of wine you've been saving for your maiden voyage. Or how about this? You can use this area as a mobile office or even a place to hop online and see what type of adventure you wanna to have tomorrow. Is your phone running out of juice? There is wireless charging with USB-C and A ports built right into this booth. Here's a great standard feature you'll find on both Gemini floor plans, the WineGuard Connect 2.0 4G hotspot and Wi-Fi extender. What this means for you is a safe, secure internet connection no matter where you happen to be traveling. You can use a data plan from any carrier or through WineGuard and it is so easy to set up your own one password internet connection. And now you know you are safe even when you tap into nearby Wi-Fi signals. So the 23TW has this fully loaded campsite kitchen. You have a gas cooktop, convection microwave, and there is a cover for the large single bowl sink when you need more counter space. You have a double door fridge and just a massive amount of storage in here. There are a number of cabinets and drawers. Now, one of the big questions we get asked is, can you access the bathroom with the slide in? You sure can. And for a motorhome under 24 feet long, you will be impressed with all the room. So when it comes to bedtime, the 23TW offers you this flip up queen bed. And here's what's really cool about this. In the morning, you can just flip it up out of the way. Now you have a bench here, which is perfect for sitting and grabbing that morning cup of coffee. So go ahead, sit back, watch the day's forecast on the bedroom TV while you choose your outfit out of the very large mirrored closet. The 23TW offers a lot of what you need, but what if what you really need is a Murphy bed? Then this is what you need, the 23TE. You're seeing this here in the home collection. So let's not waste any time. Here it is. Look at that setup. This is where you'll crash after an exhausting day exploring. And here's another great feature. It flips up in seconds. Now you have this sofa. There's a pedestal table that is easy to set up. Now you're ready for dinner. And with a kitchen setup like this, you will have no problem whipping up all your favorite meals. So as you can see, the kitchen here is campsite. And for those who cannot have enough counter space, just let all of this room sink in. Go ahead, let your recipes run wild. As you have on both floor plans, the two burner gas cooktop, right down below here is your convection microwave, surrounded by drawers. You have cabinets right across is your fridge. Now, if you look close, you'll find something hidden right here in the countertop, this retractable TV. So if you love following along with cooking shows, you're gonna love this setup. And I wanna mention there is back around the roof if you'd like to add a satellite dish. One more trick feature to point out, built right into the same countertop, is a wireless phone charger. You have USB-A and USB-C ports. That is a great feature to have because you're gonna want your phone fully charged when you start using Rapid Camp Plus. First step, download the RV Master app and check this out. New is the cloud. So as long as the main unit in your RUV has internet connection, and you do, no matter where you happen to be, you can now control your lights and your climate. Real quick, let's look at the main screen. You have controls for lights, your climate, your water pump. You can check your tank levels. You can set the auto gen start for the 4,000 watt gas generator. You can put your slides out. You can bring them in. On the 23TW, you can even lower your electric stabilizers. And when we go outside, we'll show you how to put out your power awning. When you are living the RV lifestyle, you are gonna to wanna to make sure you can pack everything you need for your trip. You never know where you are gonna end up. Well, that is not a problem in here. Look at this large closet and stacks and stacks of drawers. Another impressive Gemini feature is the size of this bathroom. You have a ton of counter space up here. Right below, you have little cubbies for extra soaps and anything else you need. Your shower and foot flush toilet round out your Gemini bath. While we're talking plumbing, I wanna mention both floor plans have 31 gallons of fresh water, a 37 gallon gray tank, and a 19 gallon black tank, and you do have heat pads on those tanks as well. 
As we look from back to front, you'll notice the captain's chairs do swivel, and right up above when you want natural light, this powered skylight. As much as I like sitting here and entertaining, I love when the seats are faced the other way. I think you will too. So what do you say we get this Gemini out for an RV road test? One of my favorite parts of traveling in a Gemini all-wheel drive is getting to the next destination because the cockpit is comfortable and it is packed with technology and safety features, which we will go over as we hit the road. First thing you're gonna wanna do is dial in the comfort of your seat. You have controls over here on the left-hand side. You have a tilt and telescoping wheel so you can get the perfect fit for your adventure. Over here on the door sill, window controls, you do have locks. You have controls for your mirrors, they are heated. You have headlight controls over here, a button for your fog lights. You can dim and brighten the dash lights as well. Let's take a look at your steering wheel because there is a lot happening here. Over here on your right, the buttons over here control the menu and you have a number of different selections over here. You have driver assist functions, which we are going to talk about when we hit the road. I mean, we are talking lane departure warning, pre-collision assist, we'll get into that. You can go up and you also have, it's called My View, and it's a heads up display. You can display whatever information you want, such as a trip meter or your speedometer as well. You have a number of settings to go into. Bluetooth connectivity, once you connect your phone, you can see that is up here. Music to control your radio. You do have volume controls over on these as well, as well as mute. You can change your channels from the thumb buttons right down here. Sync 3, which we'll talk about, is also voice activated. You also have navigation, and we are right back to the beginning. The button over here on the left is how you set your cruise control. This does have adaptive cruise control. You can adjust the distance between the car in front of you with the thumb button as well. You can set a limit on the speed that you want the Gemini to hit. And then you have volume controls and mute over here. Moving over here to your right, a number of switches over here is your mode button. Press that. What drive mode do you want? Normal. You have eco, you have slippery, you have mud and ruts, you also have a tow haul mode as well. Over here, this button is for your traction control as you move over your HVAC controls and you have auto engine start. And what that does is it actually takes and shuts the engine off when you are at a stoplight. And when you put your foot on the accelerator, the engine will fire back up. Moving to your SYNC 3 system, this is packed. You have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, you can send text, you can receive text. It is voice activated, one of my favorite setups here. You do have navigation, and I do want to point out it is not RV specific navigation, but you do have the option of getting points of interest, a number of other features, so it can really help you out there. But if you have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto on board, well, then you can find an RV navigation app that you like. You can then connect it to your phone and you do have it right up here on the big screen for you. Do have your gear shift right here, which we are about to put into drive. I do want to point out though that you do have a manual mode. If you put it into manual, you have a thumb button where you can upshift and downshift on the gear selector as well. So I'll tell you what, I'm gonna put on my seatbelt, I'm gonna shift into drive, we're gonna hit the highway and show you what this EcoBoost can do. The Gemini is what I like to call a vehicle built around smiles per gallon because it puts a smile on my face every single time I get behind the wheel. Big part of that has to do with this powertrain. This is a 3.5 liter EcoBoost twin turbo V6. It's kicking out 310 horsepower and 400 pound feet of torque. That's tied into the 10 speed transmission. Ford tuned this transmission for better acceleration in your low and mid ranges, which is perfect when you put the hammer down. This is like a little rocket ship. Not that you need your motor home to be a rocket ship, but if you do, this is the one for you. And what's really nice is when you're merging into traffic, your rear view camera is right up here and it is always on. Now that we're on the highway, I wanna talk a little more about your transmission. It does have a tow haul mode. That's going to adjust the shifts for you and it's gonna keep that transmission running at peak performance. Now a little more on that all wheel drive. It is intelligent all wheel drive. And all this means is Ford has this thing tweaked. So the torque is balanced between the front and the rear wheels. This is gonna give you better handling. It's gonna give you better traction. It's just gonna give you a more confident, smoother handling ride. Gemini is loaded with safety features as well. I wanna talk a little bit about each and every single one of them, starting with our adaptive cruise control. We talked about the controls on the left-hand side. What this is gonna do is allow you to set your speed and the Gemini is gonna take and automatically adjust the speed of the Gemini to the vehicle in front of you and you can make adjustments with the thumb controls on your left. 
A little more on the auto high beams we talked about. The Gemini is going to sense an oncoming vehicle or pickup on the taillights in front of you, and it's going to kick off the high beams. It's as simple as that. You do have hill start assist on this. This is going to keep you from rolling backward or forward on the hill. Keeps brake pressure applied for two seconds after you let up on the brake and you step on the gas. The Gemini knows you're on a hill. It's going to do this automatically. There's nothing you need to do on your end. The lane keeping system is a great feature to have. We showed you how to turn it on or off with the stock here on your left. If you start to drift, the steering wheel is going to vibrate and it's going to feel much like running over a rumble strip. The Gemini is equipped with advanced track and roll stability control and here's how this works. So let's say your wheel's starting to slip, right? The engine will actually cut back on all that power. It will apply brakes to whatever wheel needs it and it does this with no setup on your end. You never have to think about it and it's going to react a lot faster than you can. Now as for that roll stability control, it works a lot like advanced track but this monitors the body roll angle of the Gemini. If it picks something up isn't quite right, again, the engine's gonna cut back on power. It's going to apply the brakes that are necessary to keep you from rolling over. In inclement weather, you'll be glad you have side wind stabilization. There are sensors all over this, and if it picks up a wind gust, it is going to react and apply brakes to keep you from being pushed into the lane you shouldn't be in. There are a couple other safety features built in that react automatically so you never have to think about it. The first one is pre-collision assist with automatic emergency braking. This works anytime you're behind the wheel of the Gemini. The Gemini also features rain sensing windshield wipers. And this is really cool. They actually turn on and adjust speed when they sense it starts to rain outside. So a lot of great safety features in tech. In this Gemini, there are also a lot of great features on the outside, so when we get to camp, we are gonna put this thing into park, put the slide out, and show you around. It's always so much fun getting to wherever it is you happen to be going, and when you are out here set up, it's hard to take your eyes off the Gemini, whether you are going with one of the full body paints or the HD Max with Atlantis Blue like you see here. It's gonna stay beautiful for years to come as the Gemini is backed by the best warranty in the industry. You have 12 years on the structure, a six year lamination, and one year limited warranty. On a day like today where the sun is shining, you'll appreciate that the Gemini comes standard with 100 watts of solar charging. So maybe you're wondering, what am I gonna take with me? How about this setup? You have the ability to bring along all your gear as the Gemini has rotocast storage bays ready for whatever you wanna toss in it. Maybe it's muddy boots. And here's what's great. You have an exterior shower so you can just hose those boots off and toss them in the bays before you head out on your next hike. A few items you may want to bring along are right here. Your camping chairs and maybe a grill. Yeah, your own grill. And you can hook it up to the exterior propane connection and barbecue away. We also talked about putting out the power awning with Rapid Camp Plus. Yeah, just pull it up on your phone. Now sit back, enjoy the outdoors, because these are the adventures you'll be talking about for a lifetime. This is the 2022 Gemini all-wheel drive. For all the features, specs, and to find the Gemini floor plan made to fit you, visit ThorMotorCoach.com.